We begin with breaking news in Gwinnett County where police are searching for a semi-truck driver that they say caused a serious crash that injured a family. The hit and run happened in the southbound lanes of I-85 at Steve Reynolds Boulevard. Channel 2's Kerry Cavanaugh is live there now to explain how the SUV flipped from the interstate onto the on-ramp. Kerry. John, police tell us the SUV carrying two parents and two children was traveling southbound here on Interstate 85. They say a semi went to change lanes and it clipped the front of this SUV. That sent it spinning into another large truck and then it catapulted up over this embankment at least 20 feet, clearing the guardrail and landing on the on ramp. We have video of the SUV on that entrance ramp from Steve Reynolds Boulevard. Gwinnett County Police blocked it for a couple of hours this afternoon as they invested. Police say the father and two children are okay. The mother was taken to the hospital in serious condition. And now police are searching for the driver of that semi that they believe triggered this all. The driver of the 18 wheeler that started the whole chain of events, he did not stop. Um, we do have good leads into who it was that was driving that vehicle, which vehicle it was. And police say they believe that the back of the semi struck the front of the SUV, so it is possible that that driver didn't realize that he struck anyone. We will keep you up to date as they search for that driver, and we'll also let you know the latest as soon as we find out any new information on the condition of this mother. We are live in Gwinnett County, Kerry Cavanaugh, Channel 2 Action News.